Coronavirus, Premises and Equipment Disinfection Guide. In this video, we will explain the current guidance for cleaning surfaces and equipment during this pandemic. There isn't much research into surface cleaning for SARS-CoV-2. However, there is information on other coronaviruses. Sodium hypochlorite has been found to be effective against other coronaviruses and is found in most household bleaches. Sodium hypochlorite 0.1% or a solution containing 70% ethanol are found to be effective on small surfaces after a contact time of a minute. For larger areas, such as floors, 0.5% sodium hypochlorite is advised. You can dilute household bleach from a traditional 5% to get your desired strength. Similar results were obtained with common disinfectants and detergents. They require longer contact times, however, sometimes up to five minutes to achieve the same results. Please be aware that household bleach is damaging to some surfaces. In those cases, decontamination can be carried out with household detergent followed by a solution containing at least 70% ethanol. So, what should you do in practice? First, check the manufacturer's instructions to make sure that the cleaning products won't harm equipment or fixtures and fittings. If in any doubt, contact the manufacturer. Secondly, check that the cleaning products that you're using have the required ingredients. Use a 70% ethanol solution to disinfect reusable equipment between patient uses, as long as it's safe to do so. This would apply to headrests, chin rests, handles, trial frames, and similar. You can use antimicrobial wipes, but you must ensure that they contain the active ingredients in sufficient quantities and that you have enough contact time. To disinfect commonly touched surfaces, use a 0.5% sodium hypochlorite solution. Wherever possible, use a disinfectant or detergent solution followed by either a sodium hypochlorite 0.1% solution or a 70% ethanol solution. However, in some instances, that won't be practical or possible. Soft surfaces are more difficult to clean. The current recommendation is to remove them from patient areas and replace them with hard surfaces if possible. While cleaning, you should wear PPE. For more information, see our video on PPE. Data on COVID-19 is still emerging. All information in this video was correct as of the 21st of April.